Hey everyone. Okay, so recently the Walt Disney Company announced a major billion dollar expansion to Disneyland Paris Resort. More specifically, the Walt Disney Studios Park. Now this park is arguably the worst park Disney has ever built. Okay, it, it, it looks absolutely horrendous. Really low attraction count. This park needs a ton of work and our friends in Paris should get very excited because Disney is investing a lot of money into making this park top notch. What are they doing to this park? Well, they're gonna add a Star Wars land, which from the concept art looks like it might be a little bit of a scaled down version of Star Wars land that we're getting here in Anaheim and in Florida. That's not confirmed. I'm just going based on the concept art. But even if it's scaled down, who cares? This is a very much welcomed addition to this park. They are getting a Marvel Land, okay? They're also getting an, uh, um, an addition to um, their Toy Story Playland, a new attraction, which I believe is the Alien Saucer Ride they're getting in Florida. And the creme de la creme, the best part of this whole thing, in my opinion, is the new Arendelle Frozen Air section or land, <laughs> where it is literally the, the mountain, the, the, the ice palace that Elsa lives in. Um, next to this gorgeous beautiful lake and Arendelle sitting below it looks breathtaking absolutely breathtaking this is exactly what that that the this is exactly what the Walt Disney Studios Park needed they needed a huge investment into this place because it was really bad Th this park it was really really um low on attractions, low on eye candy, it wasn't that attractive looking. This renovation is gonna change all of that. It's gonna make Walt Disney Studios really the bell of the ball in a lot of ways. I mean, people are gonna love this park when it, when all this is done. And I am really excited for, for you, know, um, you know, our Disney friends in Paris because we recently here in Anaheim went through something very similar with a park redo. You know, in 2007, they announced, you know, California Adventure was going to get all new lands. They're going to reinvent the whole park. And it was really a lot of fun to watch, you know, the park go through with transformation. And, you know, it's, it's, I'm really excited for Disneyland Paris fans to have that same opportunity now with the Walt Disney Studios Park and to go year after year and really watch everything grow and evolve. It's a lot of fun, you guys, and I'm really happy for everyone over there for this big expansion. This is really going to put Walt Disney Studios Park on the map, a very much welcomed addition. And actually, you know, this is the park. This is the concept that a lot of people in in the States were, were really wanting Disney to do with like Star Wars Land and Marvel, which was make a, a whole park dedicated to like Star Wars Marvel and like a lot of the IP a lot of the franchises, you know This is what a lot of people wanted as opposed to kind of like, you know Adding Star Wars into Disneyland and adding Frozen into Epcot a lot of people wanted all of those IPs in one park Now Paris is getting that they're getting their franchise park and I think it's gonna be phenomenal I am very much excited and I am a, I am unapologetically a huge Frozen fan. I love Frozen and I am so jealous of Paris for getting this Arendelle area. It looks absolutely breathtaking, but I'm really happy for you guys. But what are your thoughts on this entire Walt Disney Studios expansion? What do you guys feel about it? What are your thoughts? Comment below. I love to hear from you guys. Like, subscribe. I do content on Disney all the time. And as always, have a wonderful day.